All right, guys, welcome back to another live stream. The reason I'm actually doing an intro this time is because this is going to be a video afterwards. The video is going to be a little bit weird because I'm going to be speaking to a chat at the same time. So I do apologize about that if you are watching this as a video. I thought we we're going to change it up a little bit this time around. I thought, hey, why not do a live read through of the trophies? I normally do a trophy video every single time that new DLC comes out, but I thought today, why not? Let's just actually read through them on a live stream and interact with you guys and see what you guys think about it as well as me because that made me feel a lot better. So I didn't know the trophies for DLC 3 are now in the PlayStation, well, trophy section. I was going to say PlayStation Store, but they're in the trophy section. You can go and view them right now for yourself. So this isn't fake. Like, this is. I don't understand how this could be fake. But yeah, in case you've got that image inside your head that this is uh, possibly fake, it's not. Let's uh, quickly, because this is still a live stream, let's say hello to everyone in chat because obviously, as I said, this is a live stream as I'm doing this, but it will be a video afterwards. Uh, let's see, let's see. So what is up, School Ghost, Sean, Omi, Poisonous, uh, Flamer, James, Potsy, Lewis, and uh, Games. How y'all doing? Nice and early. So uh, we're about to find out our first bit of information about DLC 3 for World War 2. So the actual DLC itself is called United From. Okay, weird name, I know. But I mean, the actual zombies map itself is called The Tortured Path, which I think is super cool. Anyway, uh, what's up, Kaden? What's up, Dazza? Uh, vid will have chat now. Oh, oh yeah, vids have chat now. So if you are watching this as a video, you'll be able to see the chat and see that I'm not talking to myself. So anyway, the zombies map is called the Tortured Path, which in my opinion is a sick name for a zombies map. But the the, the first trophy is called Ride of the Century in the Tortured Path. Complete hundred objective waves. Are objective waves just the like the the pest round? I don't know what that means. Maybe that's something new coming to the same map. Maybe objective waves are just classed as pest round, which I don't think they are. I think they're classed as special zombie rounds. So there's going to be some new sort of um, some objective wave in the next DLC. Sounds pretty cool there. What's up, Nikel? What's up, Space Dive? What's up, Chopper? Got you guys are just floating in right now. This is this is brilliant. So uh, yeah, it says complete 100 waves in the charts of path. So okay, whatever. Uh, the next one is a uh, hidden trophy. Should we save the hidden ones to the end or should we do them now? Hmm. Let's do them now. So the first hidden trophy is in the tortured path assemble the sword of barbarossa what's up game from the glory so there you go there's there's the proof there's the confirmation should i say we're gonna be assembling the sword of barbarossa inside this map that's gonna be so sick i cannot wait to get this sword fully put together and to actually use it in its full form this is gonna be this is gonna be so good what's up game for glory how you doing man so the second trophy is assemble the sword of barbarossa i mean that's not the that's no no that's not the easter trophy okay um the next one is i'll be home for christmas in the tortured path successfully escape from beneath the ice what from beneath the ice are we going to some sort of ice caven that's a bronze trophy though so would this be the easter egg trophy then i'm thinking yeah, it's the icy mountains. So ice, yeah. So I'm thinking that this is the actual Easter egg quest. The quest that we're doing is assemble the sword of Barbarossa. Okay, that's pretty cool because there's no way. Success to be made. Oh, maybe that is. I don't know. Hmm. I don't know because they're both bronze trophies, so I really cannot decide. Uh, they apparently there are three maps. Ah, oh, but we'll get to that in a minute. Okay, don't get me excited already. God damn it. So the next one is called Over Engineered in the Tortured Path to collect 25 engineered parts. I don't know what engineered parts are. We're going to find out when the map comes out. This sounds pretty cool. Anyway, uh, the next one is Seasick and the Tortured Path successfully escaped from, from across the depths. Hmm. From across the depths. I don't know, but that, that sounds awesome, doesn't it, guys, already? What the hell? And uh, before we do continue... There is 30 plus people watching right now. If you all could drop a like and get this stream to 30 likes before it even goes live, that would make it do really good. The YouTube algorithm, that would mean a lot to me, guys. So if you could right now, drop a like on the video and let me know in the chat who's just liked right now and I'll, uh, I'll give you all a cookie. I'm not really going to give you a cookie, but just imagine that I was going to give you a cookie, okay? It makes it go smoother. Um, so yeah, the next one is in the Tulsa Pass. Successfully escape from across the depths. Okay. And before we go on, let's say thank you to everyone who's just liked. Uh, so thank you for liking Daniel Gomez, uh, Lewis, Dazza, Game for Glory. Thank you all for them new likes. But we're on 
20 likes now or 22 likes now actually <laughs> she doesn't like in pussy she doesn't like in games you begging me a damn cookie on me i'm sorry i actually don't have any cookies on me it was just it was a nice gesture okay uh cheers for liking the chopper little human just another kid gamer that's where'd you get that name from mate where'd you get that name from Whew. all right anyway anyway let's actually move on um in the tortured path successfully escaped for from into the storm there is so much that we're escaping. What the hell? So in total here, Fortnite zombies just escape the storm. <laughs> so yeah, we've got in this one on the Toshi path, escape from beneath the ice, escape from across the depths, and escape from into the storm. Are these separate maps? Hmm. That that'd be obviously weird if there was. Is there any exo zombies maps that can really link to escape in a storm that I can think of? That's just very weird, that, actually. Oh wait, in the tortured path, defeat the guardian solo. Whoa, there there is more than one map. There is no, there there is one. There's two maps. In the tortured path, defeat the guardian. Oh no 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 no, that's the boss. The boss is called the guardian. That needs to live up to its name. That needs to live up to its name. If it's the Guardian, the Guardian's protecting where we make the Sword of Barbarossa. So this Guardian better be strong. This Guardian better have like wings and shiz on its back like a sword, you know. When I think of a Guardian, that's what I think of. A big winged like thing with swords, you know, lots of powers. So uh, yeah, that's the boss fight. The boss is called the Guardian, so... Okay, like a stone giant, yeah, like a stone giant. That's exactly what I was thinking of. Okay, that's that's, that's pretty sick. Now we got um, three hidden trophies. It's Goliath, so it has wings. Oh, okay. Okay, anyway, uh, there's three hidden trophies left. Let's take a look at them. First one, in social path, find and shoot class. What? What? I thought he's dead. I thought he's dead. Uh, dude, I'm, I'm not Richie Ross comment. Sorry, uh, la, 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 I, I've, I've lost it. Uh, Klaus is dead. How, all right, unless when, if we think back to the final Reich, he said some weird stuff, didn't he, before he got blown up? Maybe he didn't die, like blow up. Maybe he, maybe he's become the devil himself. I, I, I don't know because obviously. Uh, that German guy, I forgot his name. That, how, do, how do I forget one of the main enemy's names? But yeah, he's dead anyway. We killed him in the last one. So if Klaus is back, then Klaus maybe was the real enemy this entire time. And what about if Klaus is the best Lababro? Oh, that's that's very true. What about if it is um, the best Lababrosa? Hmm. Cameron tinted it was alive. Well, he's definitely... Oh, it's Straub. That's it, that's it. I got the trophies for this stream, World War 2, to prep for DLC 3. I'll do that as a separate stream. This is a trophy reveal, so that's all I want to do for this one. But damn, okay, so Klaus is not dead. Klaus is back, Alan. Wow, okay, let's just go into the next one. The next one is in the tortured path, reach the max bureau ranking. What? Is there a new way to level up? Reach the max bureau ranking, and that's a silver trophy. I don't know why, but for me, to me, that sounds like I tweeted out an idea about being able to earn specific rewards in the map by ranking up something, and it seems like they may have actually put that into the game. Like this was my idea. I said in a zombies map we should have a ranking system, but it was called a hero rank, where you'd get extra things inside the map by doing stuff in the map and ranking up something. So if that's a ranking in game, they literally they literally see my idea and they put my idea into the game. That's so cool. That's what they've done. That is so so cool. And uh, the final trophy for the tortured path is in the tortured path successfully escape from every map without using blitz. What? From every map? What? I don't, I don't know what to say. There's more than one map coming. There is for sure. There's more than one map coming this DLC. What? This has shocked me beyond belief. What the actual F? 
So we know that the tortured path is called the tortured path because there's three separate paths we can take. So in itself, that is amazing. It's not three maps confirmed. The tortured path has three separate paths, which I'm presuming is a three different theme maps because as you can see on one of the paths, we're escaping from beneath the ice. So we're gonna be obviously in some sort of ice setting. The second one that says escape from across the depth. To me, that sounds like water. So maybe there's like a water themed. And then the third one is to successfully escape from into the storm. So maybe a storm type. So this math consists of three different paths that we can take, which is why it's called the tortured path. Which path do we want to go down to be tortured more? That's, I think that's the message they're getting across. So yeah, that's going to be like kind of the idea of how the map's going to work. There's going to be three separate paths, which are, is definitely cool. We then know that the the main objective, first of all, is getting Barbarossa's sword. We're going to be assembling Barbarossa's sword in this map, finally. And then we know that the boss of this map is going to be called the Guardian, which hopefully it lives up to its name. A Guardian should have loads of abilities. It should be super powerful. It should be teamwork needed to take it out. But obviously, there is a solo. This is like the solo thing and they can't change the deck fully. So maybe the teamwork, it won't work. But um, it, God damn it, Sledgehammer, you need to make this boss fight the best that it's got to be. Like this has to be a Mistopheles type boss fight. This has to be powerful. This has to be mechanic based because it's the Guardian. It's guarding the rest or maybe just the thing to build Barbara to saw. This is going to be an amazing map. And then after all that amazing stuff, they surprise us. I say an escape from every single map without using Blitz. Every single map. There is no way they are putting a trophy on this DLC for all the maps. They would have put that in the vanilla World War II. This, like, vanilla means original. So if that was a thing, they would have added a new Zombies trophy to the bottom of this here. But they didn't. So we're getting more than one map on this DLC, which... Wow, Sledgehammer may actually bring home the gold this time. I'm, let's just hope that we're not hyping this up for no reason. Like I said, take everything I'm saying right now. Take everything you're thinking inside your head. Sprinkle salt on it. No, no, that makes sense. That doesn't make sense. Take it all with a grain of salt. And uh, yeah, let's just see what they got for us. I mean, with the trophies being out now, that means the DLC could be out next week, guys. You do know this, right? They normally release like the, the trophies about a week or so before the DLC. So this map... <laughs> Excuse me. It's coming out either on the 19th or the 26th. My guessing is we're going to get the trove, the trailer on the 19th, maybe. And then release on the 26th. Or they're pulling an Attack the Radioactive thing on us. And the, tr the trailer and the map is all coming out next week. Which, if so, if it's coming out next week, I'm done. See you later. I'm joking, I'm joking. I've got a video that I've got to finish, okay? We've got to finish this video at some point today. But, I mean, if it's coming next week, this has literally broken me right now. I don't know what else to say, I don't know what else to do. I am broken right now. I think I may have just nearly broken my, you know, my new headset as well. But, uh, yeah. But, yeah, I'm thinking the 26th, okay? I'm thinking the 26th because, like, yeah, there you go. So, I was literally about to say that. The zombie event finishes in, uh, in about 10 days or so. So when that finishes, that'll be the 25th. And it'll actually be just in time for the 26th. So maybe a trailer next week released on 26th. More than likely. I I'm going to put at least 9% on that that's going to be there. Like that. But this is a video. And I've gone on for quite some time now. This video is now 20 minutes long. Okay, I didn't, I didn't mean for it to be 20 minutes. So I, I apologize if you're watching it afterwards. But hey, you've got a little bit to watch. A little bit of entertainment before you go to sleep. Before you touch yourself. Just, just don't be touching yourself, you know, looking at this face. Anyway, guys, we're gonna uh, we're gonna end the stream there. Um, I'm as you can tell by the stream, I'm super pumped. I'm super excited that we finally got information for DLC three, and now all we gotta do is just just wait to see what happens, wait to see what comes. Yeah, I'm afraid I'm gonna have to end the stream because this is a trophy reveal stream only. I'm probably gonna boot up World War Two tonight and do some World War Two maps. You know, just get hyped for DLC three. So make sure you guys do uh, to stick around. I like how you are all putting hey future. Okay, so if you're watching this as a video, everyone's saying hello to you right now. But yeah, guys, it's been fun. These are all the trophies. Just as a quick, you know, overcap before we go. The map's called the Tortured Path. There's going to be three different paths we can take. It looks like there's an ice themed, a water themed, a storm themed. I could be completely wrong. But there's definitely three separate paths 
there's actually two maps coming as well with this DLC, which is mind blowing again. But we're going into the video. If you did enjoy it, leave a like and uh, yeah, subscribe if you are new to the channel. Thank you for watching the video. Thank you for everyone who's stream. You're all about to get hello messages from the past, guys. So be prepared for that. But uh, yeah, thank you all for watching, guys, and I will see you all in the next video and the next live stream.